Morning all, how are we? Hope we're well. Hope we're all good. Just wait for a few people to join us. Morning everyone, there's quite a few on Twitter coming on already. Morning everyone on Twitter world, how are you? Facebook's a bit slow as normal. Morning, morning Ern, uh, our Ern, sorry, can't pronounce it. Morning all, morning Matthew, Matthew's always the first one on here. Hope you're all well, hope you're good. Morning Matthew, morning Simon, blimey you're up early Simon, morning Jason. Morning Anna, NA, how are you? Hope you're well, there's quite a few on Twitter coming on. Graham, how are you? Nigel, morning all. You are early, Luke. You are early. Hope you're all well. Morning, Colin, on uh, Twitter. Hope you're well. Hope you're good. Right. Everyone's. What a decent day it was yesterday. So I just, I just forgot something. Sorry. What a decent day it was yesterday. I bought myself a new tablet and now, now I can't see anything on it. Oh blimey, this hasn't worked. This hasn't what I thought it would. Right. Two seconds, let me just change something. Right. That's better, I can see things now. Morning everyone, how are we? Morning Alex, how are you? Morning Adam, oh you're a bit sleepy Adam. Morning Jack, right. Let's get on. Yesterday's game, everyone, Twitter as well. Yesterday's game. Where do you start? Where do you actually start? So uh, I'm just having a few problems with my uh, tablet. I can't see your comments. Right, let's, let's get started. Too much messing about now. Too much messing about. Um, <sighs> Would you keep Justin in at right back and play? <sighs> well, Pereira had a bit of a bit of an injury, didn't he? So, all right, Matthew, how are you? Pereira, great result. Changed the whole team. Yeah, we started well, didn't we? There was a bit of a everyone that said that Brendan Rodgers. Uh, they were complaining about Brendan Rodgers changing the team, changing the team, nine changes. They were complaining about it. It worked. It showed that we've got a decent team. No, it's not that. I can't see the screen. It's not. Oh, no, you don't want to do that, do you? That's made me bigger. Right. I had all these good ideas. Um... Why the negative comments? Let's right, let's get started. Why the negative comments when we had six title winners in that starting lineup? There were six title winners in that lineup. So why the negative comments? There was a decent team there. I had little Karen, I had little confidence in the team selection, but Brendan knows his team so well. Yes, he does. He does. He certainly does. He knows his team really well. He picked a good squad. He picked a team that we needed to pick against. Um, so I'm just... That's better. I can see now. Um, right. Let's start again. Sorry for, for the... At the start. There were six title winners in that team. Six title winners. Morning everyone on Twitter. Why were people moaning and groaning about the team? We needed changes to make it. And we did. If you think of the title winners we had on there, down with the Villa. <laughs> Antone, I think Villa are going down as well as West Ham. It's a squad, not yes, correctly, it's a squad game, not just 11 players. Not just 11 players. Um, do you know, and also as well, I'm glad he made the changes because it actually, yes, we are staying up, aren't we? Lineker's apples, yes, we are staying up. I said we've got enough points to stay up. Um, 
when the team comes out, you have to you have to support them. Plan B, squad players put in a performance. Yeah, that was our plan B. Put in a, a, a performance in like that. We did really well. I'm struggling with this this morning. Right. We need changes. But I think people worried that we haven't won a game of late. I think that's what it was. I think that was what it was. We needed changes, to be honest. I was annoyed yesterday. The negative... Yes. So was me, David. You support the team. You support the team. You don't support the first 11. You support the whole team. That's what we needed. Well, I think now Kelty Jack has got six goals in... Uh, no, five goals in six games. Magic Mendy. Hashtag magic. Hashtag. How the devil are you? Your old mate came back and played pretty well. James Justin had a great game. Yeah, James Justin did have a great game to play more. Second at Christmas. Second, end of the decade. What more do you want? The start of the decade, we were seventh in the championship. Now, we're in, the, we're in second place in the premiership at the end of the decade. What more do you want? You couldn't have asked for more than that. Where was Vardy, Gaz? Uh, Vardy was at the birth of his, I think, his baby girl. Did he have a baby girl? Or was it a boy? It was a girl, wasn't it? It was a baby girl he had. So that's why he wasn't playing. He needed the rest anyway. I think that was a shot when she... I've... See, right. I did a bit of a... I did a bit of a thing on the players. On all the players. See if you can... Uh... Second in the league. Yeah. Who was that comment from? In the... on Twi I can't. It's gone now. Sorry. Um. His newborn daughter, yes, he had a baby girl. I wasn't quite sure. I'm good after that, a good performance. It was a good performance from the second team, wasn't it? It really was. You're here though, Neil, aren't you? You're here though, baby girl, yeah. Okay, guys, as long as we all know you were joking. Uh, my, thing, my little thing on the um, players yesterday. Sorry it's a bit hit or miss today. I'm having a few problems. with The, the sun being out, it's making it hard. Um... I was perhaps a bit OTT negative after the Liverpool results. Hindsight is a wonderful thing. Lineker's apples, yes, second. Yes, Jason, hindsight is a wonderful thing. But I think we all thought the same as you, to be honest. Chowdhury was. Right, I'm just going to see my... My bit on the players that I thought yesterday. Not in order, just how I wrote them down. I thought JJ had a good game. His first full Premiership game. Do we need wingers? Do we really need wingers from Darren on Twitter? Do we really need wingers? No, that's why I said it's not really a B team, Adam, because there were six title winners in that time, in that team. A shame couldn't find consistency. Yes. See, I was a bit disappointed about him not taking the penalty, but he was the only one that, um, that had the had the balls to step up to take that penalty. I really do. He was the only one that had the had the balls to step up to that penalty. He missed it, shame. But my view on the players, JJ, I think he had a good first full premiership game. All Brighton as good as normal. Can't see why he's not in the team, to be honest. Kelsey took his goal well. Didn't do an awful lot. <laughs> you should know that, Lineker's Apples. Oh, but yeah, or Brighton. I think all Brighton does need. It gives you that bit of back and forth, back and forth. He gets all the pass. He covers all the spaces that the defenders leave, which we could have needed against Man City and against um, Liverpool. Perez. Not sure about Perez to be honest. Still not. I know he had two assists yesterday, but what did he actually give yesterday? Stop saying second team, one club. Yeah, I know, Simon, but it was it was a with nine changes, I know, with nine changes, you had to say it was sort of a B team, because if that was played Wigan, which I think the Wigan game will be roughly the same team. Morning Gray, how are you? I thought I thought Fuchs would have taken the penalty. Um But yeah. Um Mendy, where did he come from? He was out in the cold now all of a sudden and he's back I know he's only played one game and that'll probably be his last game. 
he might not be his last game he played. Depends what he wants to do against Newcastle. He might leave because Mendy. I thought he did. Now you can't request music. Get some strange comments on Twitter. Um, I do hope Wolves beat Liverpool. That would be a great result. After yesterday, that would be a fantastic result. Not a B team, it's a squad what we have. But everyone was calling it the B team. They made seven changes, we made nine changes. You going, Carlos? Good, let's hope we beat them. Mendy did his job, Kevin. Mendy did exactly what... Morning, Pete. Mendy did exactly what he should have been doing. Hamza, as good as ever. was Hamza was as good as ever as what he normally does. I, don't, I wouldn't go... I thought it was class... It's sort of a bit like an Ozazaki, isn't it? He brings the play together. But, morning, Phil. How are you, Twitter? Uh, he brings the play together, but I'm not 100% sure on him, to be honest. He did well, but I think he's still got that little bit more to give. Um, Christian Fuchs, steady game as everyone. Morning, Pete Mellis. Yeah, well, Brighton's crossing was unbelievable. He did really well. Morning, David. How are you? Casper uh, didn't have anything to do really, did he yesterday? Wes and Johnny Evans, not really troubled. Whatever they needed to do, they did. Morning, Chris Smudge. I think that's Chris Smith there. Morning, how are you on Twitter? Um, it wasn't really troubled whether whatever they did, they did well, cleared up. Morgan should have scored. Oh, what a flick in a turn that was. Or oh, Brighton to start next game. Yes, on Twitter, uh, just a fox. Morning, Glenn. How are you? Um, Man of the match. Yes, who was people's man of the match? That's what I want to know. Everyone, I'm not sure. If I was anybody, I'd give it either James Justin or... James Justin or probably Mark Brighton because he worked his socks off all Brighton did. So I'll, on the touch, I'd go for James Justin because I thought he, had, he did really well. Yeah, but what quality do we need? But that was about it though, wasn't it? It does give us Evans, yeah. Uh, I can't pronounce that one. Hola. Control. Yes, we did. We controlled the tempo how we wanted to play. But West Ham were poor, though, weren't they, on Twitter? Uh, Lineker's apples. Controlled the tempo, yes. Morning, James. How are you? Must admit, when I saw nine changes, thought, well, yes, there was a lot of that on Twitter. A lot of that on Twitter. Evans control. See, so are we going for a Johnny Evans? Or are we going for James Justin? But who do we want? Who do we need? It was the final nail in Peregrino's coffin, wasn't it? A lot of West Ham fans were saying, Mendy worked all game for me. Yes, Mendy could have... Moving on to Newcastle, nice to have options all over. Correct. We've got all options. He's, he's got some uh, minutes in team, players' legs that hadn't had it. You always need to be finding better players. Than, yes, but the players you get in January are more the ones that are not... Or Brighton, Twitter, Payne, Payne 265, Payne, or Brighton, yeah, I agree with that. Um, yeah, I think Gray, Gray and Brighton did well on their wings. They actually covered the spaces that people have been missing, that we haven't been covering in defence. Dogs don't know, they bloody feel, the dogs are a nightmare over here sometimes on a Sunday morning. I still think we could do with this, yeah, I know, Karen. Yeah, correct. Tillemans and Pratt have not been, I'll agree with that, Lee. Tillemans and Pratt have not really been at the races. Morning, Daniel. How are you? Yeah, I'll give Chilwell a proper rest uh, and play Fooch. Play Fooch a bit more. Um, right, as there's a few here, competition time again. Only on, fa sorry, people on Twitter, just on Facebook. Inacho has been great when he's been called on. I agree with that. Ticket for the Chelsea game this week. I've been given a ticket for the Chelsea game. So if you want the ticket for the Chelsea game, it's the same as normal. It's the football emoji and a thumbs up and you get entered. Just a bit of a rest, I think. He might have had a bit of a knot. He's played a few minutes, hasn't he, just recently. Consecutive games. Jared Bowen from Hull, if rumours are true. Be great. There's so many names being bandied about all the time, this time of year. This time of year. I don't think Ricardo on the wing. I prefer him at fullback. Need another? Need to find another Evans. Yeah. <laughs> How many of them about? That's a problem. So, right. So, if you want the ticket for the Chelsea game, football emoji, thumbs up. And I'll scroll through, find one. I can't remember when the Chelsea game is. First of Feb, is it? Or is that the... 
yeah, the Chelsea game. Anyway, if you want the ticket, thumbs up. A, a football and a th football emoji and a thumbs up. Changing the squad round might give one or two players a bit. I tell you what, changing the squad gives them a bit of a kick up the arse as well. Uh, that's why I think it was such a good game yesterday. Because the players that were coming in, you don't play one of the best fullbacks in the Premier League. No, correct. I agree with that. You do not play, like Lineker's Apples on Twitter has just said. Um, first of all, Mirko, my Dutch fox, how the devil are you? Tom, how are you? Tom's entered. That's how you all you have to do to enter. Football emoji, thumbs up. He said, I'm only going to what I heard from Rogers before the game. Um, it was a slight hamstring strain. Just They were just taking care of it more than actually it was out for a long time. So they were just taking care of it. Yes, it was. So it might be back for the Newcastle game, but the could well, the way it's happened, uh, Matthew, you're not entered because you won last week against West Ham. Sorry, you can't win two tickets. Same as Mick Hewitt, he won the game, he won the ticket for the Southampton game. You can't let once you've won a ticket, it's only fair. You alright, Lee? How are you? Jack, how are you? I think the most important thing is centre half. Love Wes, but yes. See, Benkovic, why hasn't Benkovic been playing much? I thought he'd have been on the bench or something. There weren't even a centre a centre half on the bench. Nice to see Pearson is doing well. Yes, at Watford. You know he would do. He's that kind of manager. Nine changes and we win 2-1 away from home. That is that's is the depth in squad. All right, Baz, how are you? Oh, Baz has entered the competition. That's how easy it is to enter the competition. Football emoji, thumbs up. That's all you need to do. Cheers, Matthew. That's how easy it is. You get the ticket. I, you enter the competition. I send it to you. And then you print it. And away you go. Perfect. Matthew's got it. Mick Hewitt's got it. What team does he start with Newcastle? I think he'll go back to the proper team. Whether he gives... Indeed, I don't think he'll give uh, Chowdhury and Mendry, Mendy a start together. But I do think um, there will be a few more changes. I think Sionke will come back in for, Ever for Morgan. Unless he drops uh, Evans and plays Wes and... Uh, so Uncle at the back, not too sure about that one. I think Evans has got to play in enough every minute of every game, to be honest. He's... Lineker's apples, Facebook don't find me funny. <laughs> great to start over, but I think great. Uh, who's that? Chris Sturridge on Twitter. Gray has great to start over Barnes. Yeah, I think Gray should start over Barnes on, on against Newcastle. But I do, I do think though that um, it's given the the, the reserves play, the, the the squad players that don't get much of a game the chance uh, to play, and I think it gave them a kick up the arse, especially the the the, fir the first first eleven. Let's put it that way. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I agree with that, Will. But I think it's Evans that's the glue that makes everything work, and the tempo through Evans. So yeah. Yeah, I think it, I think Barnes is better. Will be on the bench for the next few weeks. I do hope Gray showed his worth. He did a bit yesterday, but hopefully he starts up, plays, gets a bit better. Confidence comes into him. Maybe the penalty knocked him out. I'm glad to see him scored. Um, got to play Albright, yeah. But see, I think you ought to play Gray and Albrighton again on on Wednesday, New Year's Day, Wednesday or Tuesday. I lose my days over it. Um, but yeah. All right, Simon, that's it. Enter the competition. So, yep, Gray over Barnes. Yes, I totally... It's shown the nine players that came in can do a job when required. Yeah, because they've, they've been playing and they've got something to prove. So that's what they want. Don't forget the competition. Football emoji. Thumbs up. Ticket for the Chelsea game. That's what I need. Like Simon has. It's Wednesday. I can't... I can never remember the days at Christmas time. Gray is two hit and miss. But he's got to be having a chance now because I think the Wigan game as well on the next Saturday is going to be it'll be the same team as what it was, roughly the same team as what it was yesterday for the Wigan game. And if that if that shows up Pookie oh no, no, he's younger. 
I know you're... Oh, yeah. I know you're a big fan of art. So, d yes. Don't get started. Alex, we've had no problem with VAR this week. Uh, so let's not talk it. I know there's been lots of other problems with VAR, but VAR is... Uh, pain265, pain like the aggression from Chowdhury. Yes, it was lacking, and that's what we've got. Oh, small boy, how the devil are you? Yeah, I do need a haircut. I need it for my holiday, don't I, small boy? Talking of holiday, last next week will be my last week for two weeks. Not sure whether one of the other lads is going to do it for me, but I'll be in Jamaica for two weeks. So, just remember the competition for the Chelsea ticket, football emoji, thumbs up, and I'll do it in a few minutes. Um, so get them, get the last bits in, last entries in, football emoji, thumbs up. Morning on Twitter, how are you? Um, yeah, so when we get to the Newcastle game, it's literally roll on to the next one. What kind of team do you think we'll put out? Who do you think will what will it be? Will it be this? Will it be a first team squad? Will it be? It's a, it can be. Oh, I hated it. Every time that oh, every time they went in the penalty box and there was a tackle made, I was thinking, oh no, oh yes, it's definitely yeah, man. Um, Barnes does need to work on his finish. We've been saying that for ages. Yes. Please get rid. Uh, please get rid of. Oh, sorry. Please get rid of VAR. Sorry, Ross. I misread your comment then. Uh, Grey Star. Yes, I think he will. Um, I don't know yet, Jack. Don't know, mate. It will be soon. Well, not soon. So it'll be probably March time. I come back over. West Ham were a poor team, weren't they? Absolutely poor. I must admit, the stream I had yesterday for it was absolutely fantastic because it wasn't on TV anywhere. Um. The stream I had yesterday was absolutely fantastic. We sent out on loan. Slim and Silver. No, I don't think... I don't think uh, Slim will be... Will be uh, playing. I think they'll go Silver. I think he'll go. He's only had a day off training, hasn't he? So, I think... I think he'll have a couple of days. He'll have a date. Like, today he'll be with her. And then tomorrow we'll be back in training. So, I think Vardy will be playing... I'm struggling to find you on YouTube. I'm not on. This doesn't go live on YouTube. This doesn't carry. It's on Twitter and it's on Facebook. Chappy does the YouTube bit. He goes live on there. Uh, but you won't. You'll see the program repeated on YouTube. But I don't go live on YouTube because I haven't got enough. I can't do enough. I've got one on Twitter, one on uh, Facebook. Can't be doing with three. It's bad enough doing with three. Oh yeah, Carlos. Yeah. The last few weeks, the streams have been absolutely spot on. Um, but yeah, right, so the last entrance now for the ticket for the Chelsea game. Do you believe 57th? It looked empty. It really did. It didn't look that full. There isn't a monitor pitch side this season. Oh, there is. There is. There, there was yesterday. I saw it. It was there. Morning, David from Sydney. How are you? My uh, nephew's out in Sydney. Oh, yeah. Let's not go going on VAR. That's absolutely terrible. Right. So, the last couple of moments for your football emoji and thumbs up for the ticket. That's what you have to do. You've got to be living. You've got to be able to get to the game on the 1st of Feb. It's half 12 kickoff. So, it's football emoji and uh, a thumbs up. Bring back dear Batty from loan. Get him on the wing. No, I don't think we need him. We've got four wingers to... See, there's also a new one called Wow Sports as well. That's pretty good. He's near the box. He does the same thing. Couple... Yeah. That's what the claim to. I, it didn't look like there was that many there, to be honest. Right. So I am going to... Last few. Come on. A minute or so, and then people will. I uh, Vardy now needs three goals at Newcastle. I had a tenner of him to make the hundred club by the second of January. Oh, Pete, that's going to be a tough one. That's going to be a tough one. I think you're right there, Lee. A lot of the players do need to go. There are not many comments coming in on Twitter. Uh, there's a few comments, but not many. 
Most of them are on uh, Facebook, watching me live on Facebook. You can watch me live on Twitter if you want. Oh, there's a last-minute entry by Michael. Don't forget, football emoji and thumbs up for the tickets. Um, yeah, like I said, last week, next week will be my last week for two weeks. So I'll be doing it from somewhere special next week. Not from Jamaica. Won't be from Jamaica. Definitely not doing it from there. So, right, I am going to draw the ticket now. I'm just going to scroll through. Right, I'm just going to scroll through and have a quick look to see who wins the ticket. I will go for... What's the football? It's for a ticket, Hayden. I'm just going to draw it now. Unfortunately, you're a bit late to enter now. Right, I'm going to tick it. I'm going to tick it. I'm going to scroll down and pick a winner. I am going to go for... Let's just wiggle it down like that. And wherever it stops on the ticket. I am going to go for... It has, hold on. There's been a few that I haven't entered for a while. It stopped there. I'm going to go for it there. It's stopped there. I'm going to go for Craig Carver. That's what I'm going to go for, Craig. You've won the ticket for the Chelsea game on the 1st of Feb. That's So, Craig, you've got the ticket for the 1st of Feb, pal. It's a half 12 kickoff. Matthew, you missed it by a bit. Sorry. Great. Yeah, it wasn't a good pen, but it was the only one, Josh, that had the balls to stop. He had the balls to step up and take it. All the others didn't want to take it. I thought Fuchs might have taken it. Uh, but he was the only one that stepped up. So, Craig, are you there? Are you there, Craig? Like the new top. Xmas present. No, I've had this for ages. This is the championship winning one. And then the top. I've had this top for ages. Can't enter as can only get live. Yeah, well, that's what you have to do on here. It wasn't on the Twitter one. It was on this one, Craig. Can't enter as can only get live on Facebook. Yeah, you could have entered it on here. Well done, Craig. You've won the ticket. Can you send uh, 100% your email address so you can send the ticket to you? Well done, Craig. Right. What time is it? you all got a few more minutes left. Uh, so, well done, Craig. Make sure you send the ticket, uh, your email address. So you could have entered Kerry. Yeah, that's all you had to enter it on here. This is for the, the ticket for today, not the other competition prizes. This is the ticket for today. So you could have entered it on here. Right, so that. I quite like that one, Carl. I thought it was quite nice. Smichael should have taken the penalty. That would have been a bit of a, a Mickey take if Smichael had taken the penalty. Um, hi Stuart, how are you? Near the end of it. Well done Craig. So make sure Craig, Craig Carver, you enter. Yeah, because you are watching it on... It'd be nice to get three points on Wednesday. It would have buried it, wouldn't it? It would have absolutely buried it in the back of the net, you would have thought so. Right. So like we agreed, I think there's going to be changes for Newcastle game. Uh, I think the Wigan game next week will also be changes. I think that will be more of a... The same kind of team as what it was yesterday. Maybe Ward in for Smichael to give Smichael a bit of a rest because he don't get much of a break, does he? No, I don't think it would have been. I think it would have been, oh yeah, uh, uh, I'll take it. Although so, they must have had a think about it. Maybe Nacho was going to take it, but because he, he got the ref, because the trainer came on, he had to go off the pitch. So maybe Nacho had to take it. Who knows? I was going to take it. But because he went off, then somebody else had to take it. I think it was Nacho was meant to be the penalty taker. Of course you can enter. As long as you can get to as long as you can get to the game, doesn't matter. Maybe Nacho was going to be the penalty taker, but then because he had to go off injured, or when the trainer comes on. But right. Oh yeah. Yes, Alex. 
can we take a moment to consider how far we have come the team, as a team this decade? Ten years ago, we were struggling in the Championship. Now we're second in the Premier and have a Premier trophy in the Cabinet. Yes, we were actually seventh in the Championship. On 1st of, 1st of January 2010, we were seventh in the Championship. So we weren't, but we'd had a couple of dodgy years, haven't we? Um, what's your bottom three to get relegated? West Ham, Villa and Norwich. That's my bottom three. West Ham, Villa and Norwich. That's my bottom three. And um, Alright, let me just write that down. West Ham, Villa and Norwich to go down. Right, I've wrote that down, and let's see how close I am to that. Who's everyone else having a thought? I know we're not talking about relegation. I know we're not involved, but who's the bottom three to go down then? Just a quick subject, uh, not to... Uh, not Bournemouth. No, I don't think Bournemouth will go down. So, West Ham, Villa and Norwich. Who do people think on Twitter? In the next five years, we'll be classed as... Hopefully, we are in the next five years. Tata Villa. <laughs> so on Twitter, people out there on Twitter, who is the teams to go down? Name me three teams to go down. Mine is Bournemouth, Norwich and Watford. I'd love to smash that penalty. It was a poor from Gray, to be fair. Yeah, but it was the only one that had the cojones to step up and take it. I think West Ham will turn it around with a new manager. Norwich, Villa. Everyone's going for Villa, Norwich. Wouldn't it be good if we could finish second, win the league, and won the league and the FA Cup? You mean League Cup, Steve, don't you mean? Spot three. I was spot on with the bottom three. E who's? Watford, Villa, Norwich, Villa, Bournemouth, Norwich. You think Bournemouth is going to get it? The one I would love to go down is Burnley, but I can't see Burnley going down. It'd be nice if Burnley went down, but... Oh, there's Chris. Chris has gone for Burnley. That, see, Norwich were like us, really. Big delay on whatever that is, Mick. Norwich, Watford and Villa. I don't think Watford. I'm not sure Watford will. <laughs> Frank, I wish Arsenal would. That'd be... Most people are going for Villa. Bournemouth, Craig. Craig, don't forget to email 100% your email address, please. Southampton. No, I think Southampton are doing well. Why do people keep going for Arsenal? That's two people that have gone for Arsenal. I'll be surprised. I don't think Watford will. Once Big Nige gets in there, I think Big Nige would do well. John O'Towers. Yeah, he is doing a big, a good job. Um, but right. I'm off ski. So I shall see you next week. Defensive, yeah. Is Deitch in trouble at Burnley? Not doing as well as previous years. What what do they, what do they expect from Burnley though? What do they expect? You just it's hard to understand exactly what is going on at Burnley. What do they really want? They're only a small club in Lancashire, so what more do they want? Right, so I'm going. So it's ciao ciao, adios, good uh, goodbye. Top of the morning to you, everyone on Facebook, everyone on Twitter, <laughs> you're open. Have a good week and I'll see you next week for the last week for two weeks. So next week, come and join me. So that's, see you all later. Bye bye now.